Thank you, Wendy. Thanksgiving is just a few days away and a local organization is lending a helping hand to families in need, not only by providing them with the essentials of a Thanksgiving meal, but by providing a way to make their voices heard too. ABC 7, Francesca Constantini has the details. When you think of Thanksgiving, you think of the turkey as the main piece of the puzzle. And today, many families in Newtown picked up their turkeys and registered to vote. You got it? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Natasha Ellis is preparing for one of her favorite holiday, but this year it hasn't been easy for her and her family. You know, jobs, they don't pay you as much as you need to to get by. So, you know, it's, you know, pinching a penny here and there throughout the year. Thanks to turkey giveaways like this one, she's able to provide the main course this Thanksgiving, which brings her family together even during tough times. It's small, but it's a big part of what the day is going to be. She thanks the Hunger for Knowledge Foundation. Today, they passed out dozens of turkeys to families in Newtown. We thought that it'd be a great idea to um, come to our community and give back to them because they've given so much to us. And by their truck, a table with volunteers getting people registered to vote. While they do this annually, this year is critical as elections are underway next year. And just recently, Sarasota County commissioners voted to redistrict the county, Newtown being affected. It is something why we are even more press to get more people to go out to vote, get more people to register because unfortunately if you're not at the table, you're on the menu and they ate us up on the menu. A move the Newtown community is very vocal about. Just as important as it is to give back to our community, it's just that it's important that our community participates in the politics of our community. This is the fifth year this turkey giveaway takes place. They have since passed out more than 2,000 turkeys and registered many to vote. Reporting in the control room, Francesca Constantini, ABC7, your Suncoast News.